I think uh, quite simply it was not our night at the office really. No, here, there hasn't been too many times that I've had to stand in front of the camera and talk about it being not our night at the office. You know, even the Cove game we were competitive, we were unfortunate to lose that game 1-0. Obviously tonight, we, for some reason we were, we were very disjointed. Uh, we didn't turn up the first half. Uh, Athlone were probably unfortunate not to maybe go in two or three goals ahead. Us getting in at half time one nil meant we always then had an opportunity of, of of getting something maybe from the game. And the second half we did, we were much better second half. We played with a lot more purpose. We played a lot quicker. We created a few half chances. We created two big chances with Noah and, and success. On another day they maybe find the find the net. But unfortunately for us tonight that wasn't to be the case. Yeah, and I think it kind of been spoken about our away form this year, and it's just had to come to an abrupt end at some stage. It does, yes. Uh, all things in football come to abrupt ends. Uh, I've said it many times. This is a very competitive division. All ten teams are are all competitive. You just need to look at the results every week. You know, teams are taking points off each other all the time. You know, so there, there's nobody going into any game at any stage in the first division guaranteed picking up points. It's very, very competitive, and you have to be able to compete for the 90 minutes. And unfortunately, for this evening, we only competed for 45. And in football, more times than not, when you're only competing for 45 minutes, you end up with nothing from the game, and, and that's what happened here tonight. Yeah, and you talk about the results around us. Did it go for us again tonight? You know, so it's kind of you take us one hand, you get away with the other, but it, it kind of worked out all right for us. Yeah, look here, 10 games in, you've had two defeats. It, it, it certainly. Been a, been an okay start, let's be honest. I'm, I'm sure before the season started, there was lots of people had us maybe dead and buried. So we've proved a lot of people wrong from the start of the season. What I've said to the players in there is that them, them people that maybe doubted you at the start of the year, maybe all of a sudden might start doubting you again and coming out and, and having a wee bit of a voice when you've kept them quiet for a long time. So. What you have to be able to do now as a group of players is, is react and respond. That's how football works. It's how you react to a defeat and how you respond to a defeat. The players in there know themselves. You know, when I went in at half time, I didn't really have to say too much. They knew themselves that the first half just was unacceptable because of the level of performance that they've put in here all year so far. So, look, we dust ourselves down. We get back up the road. We're in Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday next week. Then we get ready for Cove away, which again will be a hugely difficult game. They're the, they're the team that come to Finn Park this year and, and took points off us, uh, all three of them, with a 1-0 win. So we'll expect another tough encounter. Yeah, when you talk about it, it's, I suppose you don't need any more motivation than that. It's a wee bit of revenge, isn't it? Well, yeah, you, you, you can use that, but the, the modern day footballer maybe doesn't think like that, you know, so... But it is a it is a, it's a difficult place to go. Obviously, they've got their new surface, their new lights. The ground looks magnificent. They've, they've started to get more fans into the games, more family oriented, more family fans as well. And and again, I look forward to going there. I look forward to seeing the new facilities. Feeling a wee bit jealous of them. Hopefully, at some stage, we get our new facilities to show off. But no, again, we dust ourselves down. We go again and we draw a line in the sand and move on.